this video lecture we are going to discuss about fluid mechanics in this lecture we are going to briefly discuss about problems on viscosity problems on viscosity problem number 3 an oil film thickness 10 mm is used for lubrication between the square parallel plate of size 0.9 meter into 0.9 meter in which the upper plate moves at a velocity of 2 meter per second requires a force of 100 newton to maintain the speed determine the dynamic viscosity of oil in poise kinematic viscosity of oil in stoke the specific gravity of oil is 0.95 given instead of giving the distance between the two plate they are given oil film thickness therefore your dy is equal to 10 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter then area a is equal to 0.9 into 0.9 it will be 0.81 meter square change in velocity du is equal to 2 meter per second force f is equal to 100 newton they have given another data specific gravity s as 0.95 solution this is our fixed plate the distance between your fixed plate and moving plate is dy and the moving plate moves at a velocity of du shear stress we know that tau is equal to force by area they are given your f as 100 newton and area as 0.81 substituting over here we get shear stress tau is equal to 123.456 newton per meter square next dynamic viscosity or viscosity tau is equal to mu into du by dy substituting the value of tau du and dy we get mu is equal to 0.6172 newton second per meter square in order to convert the dynamic viscosity in poise we know that 1 newton second per meter square is equal to 10 poise therefore mu is equal to 6.172 poise next density we know that specific gravity s is equal to density of liquid divided by density of standard liquid s is given as 0.95 substituting over here we get the density of your liquid as 950 kg per meter cube your last step kinematic viscosity kinematic viscosity is equal to dynamic viscosity by density you have to substitute your dynamic viscosity always in newton second per meter square therefore it will be 0.6172 divided by 950 so we get kinematic viscosity is equal to 6.496 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter square per second in order to get kinematic viscosity in stokes we know that one stoke is equal to 10 to the power minus 4 meter square per second therefore kinematic viscosity is equal to 6.496 stoke problem number 4 the space between two square parallel plates is filled with oil each side of the plate is 75 cm the thickness of oil film is 10 mm the upper plate which moves at 3 meter per second requires a force of 100 newton to maintain the speed determine the dynamic viscosity of oil in poise kinematic viscosity of oil in stokes the specific gravity of oil is 0.9 given 
a is equal to 0.75 into 0.75 that is equal to 0.5625 meter square. dy is equal to 10 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. The thickness of the oil film is 10 mm. Therefore, it will be 10 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. Change in velocity. Since initial velocity we are assuming it as 0. Therefore, du is equal to 3 meter per second. Force required. F is equal to 100 newton. And they are given your S is equal to 0 0.9. Solution. This is our fixed plate and this is our moving plate. The distance between these two plates is dy. The upper plate, that is the moving plate, moves at a velocity of u. First, shear stress. Tau is equal to force by area, that is equal to F by A. They are given your F has 100 Newton and we have calculated your A as 0 0.5625. Therefore, tau is equal to 177.77 Newton per meter square. Your next we are going to calculate your dynamic viscosity. We know that tau is equal to mu into du by dy. We have already calculated your tau value. Substituting your tau value du and dy, we get your viscosity mu is equal to 0 0.5925 Newton second per meter square. We already know that 1 Newton second per meter square is equal to 10 voice. Therefore, mu is equal to 5.925 voice. Density. We know that specific gravity S is equal to density of liquid divided by density of standard liquid. They are given your S as 0 0.9. And we know that the density of your standard liquid is 1000 kg per meter cube. Substituting over here, we get the density of liquid as 900 kg per meter cube. Your next kinematic viscosity is equal to mu by rho. We always, we have to substitute your mu in Newton second per meter square. Therefore, substituting your value of your mu as 0 0.5925 divided by 900, we get the kinematic viscosity as 6.584 into 10 to the power minus 4 meter square per second. We need to calculate the kinematic viscosity in stokes. Therefore, we know that 1 stoke is equal to 10 to the power minus 4 meter square per second. Therefore, kinematic viscosity is equal to 6.584 stokes.